The result was disappointing. The performance was still okay. Um, you know, we played pretty darn well, especially first half. Uh, really, even in the second half, I mean, statistically, um, we certainly you know, played way, you know, well enough to, to win the game. Um, we went in at halftime and, and really was talking, and, and I think we probably should have been up about 4 nothing at halftime. We, we missed some inside the six. Uh, we had guys that were just not hitting the ball like they, they're capable of. But we talked about the fact that uh, the longer you let a team stick around and, and uh, you know, then anything can possibly happen. Can you walk me through their goal that they scored from how you saw it? Uh, well, disappointing. I mean, um, you know, foul that, uh, you know, well outside the 18 that probably didn't need to be committed. Um, if we're being a little bit more disciplined, I don't think Roy commits that foul. And so then everybody's getting organized. And one of the things that we've really talked about was was getting on your mark and staying with them until the ball's cleared out of danger. And uh, truthfully, the you know the ball's hit from outside the 18. And our goalkeeper's just got to make the play. He's got to catch it cleanly, spills it out. Somebody doesn't have a mark, and it's a tap in. And so uh, pretty much the textbook of how not to defend at that point in time and, and that's really unfortunate because man we have spent a ton of time talking about the um, the tactical side of things the mental side of things being organized on set pieces and uh, to see that happen obviously was was a huge disappointment and the boys are in there beating themselves up about it and, and I think they should uh, the first three minutes or so of being in the locker room I just sat there and let them yell at each other I thought it was good for them to kind of get after each other a little bit. And so, um, you know, at the end of the day, though, I had to calm them down a little bit. And I mean, Lincoln Southeast isn't a bad team. I mean, let's not confuse that. I mean, they've got some athletes out there that can certainly play. Uh, we certainly feel like, uh, you know, we're still one of the top teams in the state, but uh, hopefully this is a learning experience as much as anything.